Yo, 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 you're back with the show, and the show is back with you. After a brief intermission, we got tired of playing golf. Uh, this is really all that's available to us that we both have right now. We couldn't link up on uh, games that we could connect with, so this is the only thing we both had right now. So, uh, Although, I personally really enjoy this game, so I don't mind much. Um, in any event, I hope you enjoy... We're gonna play some Insurgency Sandstorm. Haven't played it in a very long time. I, my understanding is that they've added a lot of stuff, so we'll see what's what. Uh, as as is you know, like you know, uh, my buddy Danny's here with me. So Danny, say hello. Mm, hello. And there you go. Hello. He's as enthusiastic as he's ever been, and away we will go, I suppose. So. Let's see, we gotta do it. Go to my thing here. Should run this from this place. Alright. <clears throat> uh what's all this? Okay, thank you. Gave me a bunch of uh gear and camo. Sweet. Awesome. Awesome. Very nice. Uh, customized it. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, I mean, loadout for starters, obviously. Advisor. You know, I'm mean, under the advisor thing. I think probably what I want. Let's see. Where's the. Uh, ah, well, this is just on this side, so, right. Right, got you, got you. It's actually a great gun. I'm just stick with it, really. Um, at least on this side. Let's do the uh, insurgents now. I took that out. So load out. Uh, right, right, right. Yeah, let's see. They have the Alpha AK. This this gun is my. I think this is my personal favorite gun of the game. This Alpha AK. Uh, no joke. Ooh. I had it on white. Was it like, uh, what they call uh, white out, which is pretty. Looks nice, you know. It's got some nice contrasts. There's also the urban digital, which is where whatever. Now this carbon fiber, I mean. Let me rock this guy. I wish we could mix and match, you know, like the way we can paint guns in a uh, Ghost Recon. I put a little white mixed with a little carbon fiber. It might be nice, you know. But for right now, I guess uh, carbon fiber it'll be. Uh, what else? Uh, Do I need that heavy a recoil grip? I'm starting to think different ways about this now, uh, as I have in the past. Like, maybe just a loading grip. What's an aiming grip? It increases the speed of aiming down the sights. What's, what is this recoil? This is the recoil. Yeah, but this gun, I mean, and I usually put on semi-automatic anyway. Let's, let's do that. Let's do reloading, because then maybe we can do some other stuff here. Like, I don't really, you don't really need the extended magazine, though, is what I'm realizing, so. Or a tracer round. And even having done that, I can't afford to put on a compensator or a suppressor. Wow. I mean, wow. All right, let's get, let's back out and see where I can maybe make some changes here. I see. Okay. So, I mean. 
depending on what we're doing, right? Light armor, I feel like, is important. I may not need this extra ammo carrier, depending on what we're going to work. So maybe I'll get rid of that. So now, with that said, that being what it is, right? Uh, can I now, at this point, like put a suppressor on, on this fire? Or, like, it's getting a little, you know, seriously. So let's do this. I'm gonna, I mean, first things first, just a regular magazine. Put on a side rail. Tracer rounds don't cost anything, although they do give your position away. Uh, they also set people on fire, though, so it's a bit of a give and a take with that. I, I have mixed. Now, are you setting it up for versus or co-op? Oh, I don't. Because if you're on versus, you're just going to have to redo all this once you jump into co-op. Drum. Should back out and look. So suppressors are nice. That's the bottom line. Uh, you definitely prefer to have a suppressor if you have a choice about. I know that. And maybe, just maybe. See, look at that. Wait. That's confusing. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, never mind. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was like, hold on. So the if what uh, so the Browning High Power also does twenty rounds if you do an extended mag on it. Huh? How about that? So still have five, five points, which means at that point, why not do a recoil grip or something? So, no reason not to. And now you've got two points to play with. Right? So. Oh, for Christ's sakes, that's why. Idiot. I mean, I suppose I could use the iron sights, but, uh... Huh. That's what was... That's why I was... That's where the points were. You know what? Fuck it. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, we'll just do iron sights. I mean, what's it gonna hurt to try, right? Always put a compass in. Well, I don't even know what do the what do the you know what we'll try it without any any aids here. Maybe we'll put a laser on it. See if that works at all. I guess. Hey, you know what? Yeah. Oh, uh, it stayed on anyway. Oh yeah, okay, right triggers I gotta move by right, so, so. Alright. 
I don't know which one I'm doing for. Let's just go. Who cares? I, I, do I need an invite from you? Should I send you one? Or what's going on? How are you? Uh, you got that? <clears throat> Let me run an ad here. Up to 96 followers. Welcome, everybody. Hello, I'm and I really do appreciate your patronage. Really appreciate the fact that you're here. Uh, that'd be awesome if we oh. get to 100. It's just a new goal. Uh, amazing. Really appreciate it. Got to run an ad real quick while this is loading up, though, and he's accepting the invite. So. Alright, I'm here. Alright, so we are doing co-op and I forget which one fight elite enemies with limited HUD limited equipment slower movement speed it sounds like a challenge uh, not as much fun hold your ground against waves of no no see extraction Checkpoint. Capture and destroy objectives. You know what? Let's do checkpoint, yeah? That's fine. I don't know if that's the one. We'll see, though. I, I think that's the one uh, we like. Who the fuck knows? <laughs> but yeah, welcome, everybody. I don't know who the four people in here right now are, um, but welcome. Happy to have you here. Um, yeah. We're at 96 followers now, just a, uh, just a few shy of 100. Um, I guess then we can start setting new goals, right? I am a little worried about Jacob. I'm not kidding about that. I know it sounds, you know, whatever, but he's a good kid. <sighs> he's a little ill. He's got multiple sclerosis and... I don't know. Usually he pops in with a ball. So. Everybody took all the advisor spots, huh? Nice.
shit. I'm done. God damn it. I probably don't need at least one of these things. Okay. Why does it not work? Shit. Obviously, do it that first and foremost. Really? Don't have enough for that, huh? How about that? God damn it, they keep fucking with me. Wow, five people in here. Watch my language. Ah, uh, they kicked me out for an activity just because I was trying to pick my... Deeply sucks. Alright, I'm ready. My bad. That's okay, I got kicked out anyway. Yeah, I saw that. I was just up by myself. <sighs> Trying to ask, you know. Guess everybody else was sorting their equipment. That was me, bro. So you weren't the only one. Uh, right. <clears throat> Those other two fucks in there weren't fucking doing nothing either. I was just standing there. I think this game's dead. I think co-op's dead, at least. It used to be this, this, this the rooms were full of people. No, first of all... It's like three or four people. You have to understand a couple of things. It's the time of night that it is. It's 3 a.m. So... I mean, it's 5 o'clock somewhere. Well, no, no, that's just it. It's not. So, like, around 7 o'clock in the morning is when you'd start seeing, like, uh... The European players coming, you know? Around the early, like, early morning. Not early morning like this. Early morning, like, you know, in a few hours from now. And most people are sleeping here. Oh, this is a full room. Right. See what I mean? This is... This happens to be the time of night that's, like, the worst time of night is all... And that's a fact. We were just in a bad room. Right. This is what I'm do. Wait, hold on. Oh, there's cars in this? Oh, yeah, there's always been vehicles, right? Yeah. Oh, he just got killed. So much stuff that I probably don't need. Like. I'm gonna get rid of this plate, uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the carrier so I can grab. Oh, he know. just got murdered. A better optic, and then I'm just gonna be on the way. Yep. We'll be right now. Sorry for the delay, folks. Wanted to make sure I had the right tool for the job. Again, if in the following minutes you like what you see at all, actually I'll run an ad while while we're not while I'm not playing. Don't forget to follow or subscribe. It's always much appreciated. Is my face even in the best spot for this game? Where's I'm trying to remember. Yeah, you should mind. Where the important things are here. You know. Yeah, cause you know who I was. You know who I almost played with the other day. We couldn't get the, our schedules quite squared off though. Uh, Matt Siv. Remember Matthew Milton, Alex? Yeah. Well, because he's in Alaska, and the time difference is all wonky. Uh, so, I remember he said, I said, well, so, what, so what time, you know? And he's, uh, you know, he said something, his time, and I was like, no, no, what does that mean for me here on the East Coast? He's like, probably like 10 a.m. or 11, 10 or 11 a.m., you know? And I was like, oh, well, okay. That's, I don't know. So how do I turn this stupid laser off? I know there's a way. That's <laughs> pissed me off. God damn it! Get fucking one shot by a shotgun, running randomly. I don't even remember how to play this game, so literally, I'm... I was doing what you're doing and just right there, bang! Guy standing right there with a shotgun. Ah, uh, I shot those sandbags. Just murdered me. I shot those sandbags, thinking they were a dude, because he scared me. Remember how I had the enemies all set to like uh, bright red? I wonder. Like you had your teammates set to bright red or something. Was that one red for stop? Well, it's all fucking retracted now, so I have no idea. Is this someone I need to kill? Is it not? Oh. Yeah, the enemies don't have nothing above their head. I don't think. <laughs> Great. So I have to fix that basically. You know, I have to remake that bright red so I don't accidentally start shooting teammates. Because that was a real concern in the early days. I did that more than I care to admit. With the shooting, of, accidentally shooting the teammates. Well, I can't tell a uh, friend from foe here, so.
Oh, what? Grenade. Did I get grenaded? He grenaded oh, me. Shit. me. <sighs> and I just can't feel my legs anymore. Uh, I fully expect to be very bad, extraordinarily sloppy at this game. So. What are you doing? You playing with a <laughs> fire on it? No, I was changing my controller. You turn into Chris? My battery. <laughs> my battery. I've never met anybody that likes to like clean his his firearms more than when like people is playing with people like Chris. He's always working on his guns and shit. I'm always telling him, like, dude, you know, like, <laughs> nah. I don't know if you think that that's, like, cool or. Yeah. Not better do, I suppose. He's American. Fascination with guns. Obsession, really. Borderline. Yeah, you know, Fetishes. Fetishes. You know, I will say, humans. You really, you're an American. You gotta be careful, dude. I mean, it's wild. I think differently. I don't associate really with mankind, like human beings in general. Just uh, you know, but that's. I still say I'm American because I'm American. That's that's. Uh, He tried to fucking suicide bomb me. What a prick. You believe the audacity? Fucking suicide bomb me. Where? Show. Show me the kill cam on this one. <sighs> I mean, I've been. Uh, you don't care. Nobody really cares. I know better than that. But. I've. I've done it again. Unhealthily. What's that? Oh, unhealthily enough, you know. Enough for. I don't know. Put it to you like this. The night we were supposed to play golf, right? Wait. I don't know. I can't even remember. Nah, nah. Now I can't even remember. I I'll put it to you this way. I didn't... I haven't slept for two nights in a row, at least. Put it to you like that. So, like... You know. I was awake all through last night and into the morning... And now, all the way into the morning, it'll probably be, it's gonna be light again in a few hours. You know what I mean? So, yep. at least two, two full days of, of you know. <clears throat> oh, I can fix my ship. I, I forgot. Just 
point shooting grip does not appear to be worth four, the four points that they uh, want for it. I got that much shoots for it. What about that one? Sounds like a blast. That cut sounds like Yeah, I just gotta find the right weaponry again, find my, you know, my aim. Because I was pretty sloppy. I made a couple good shots, I think, on the guys on the bridge when I got there and didn't see certain things. Didn't realize where I was getting shot from. Couldn't figure that out, which was upsetting. Yeah, well, unfortunately, I'm going to bail on you soon. Yeah, uh, I mean, you're saying that as if, like, uh, I was unaware of it. In fact, I mean, I pretty much told you if you're tired, you should just <laughs> get a bed. I mean, that's, you know. Yeah, I want to play one, I want to play one more. I'll be done. Before we even start it. You know. <clears throat> well, we got to get you in it, get you motivated so you can play. I mean. Pick up some late night stragglers. I am. I mean, I've, I've, been, I've been playing golf, bro. I played golf yeah, tonight, and golf, if there was one thing that, like, you know, would ruin my motivation, it'd be that, I like, played that, I was happy to play that, so, <clears throat> you know. How the hell do, you, do I look down my sights? Mm, what do you mean? Left, the uh, left trigger. There we go, there we go. No, down on the direction, because I had, like, the, 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 the laser sight view or some shit? I don't know. It was, it was stupid. Um, it was weird. It was yeah, weird. I don't know how you get rid of the lasers. I was looking at the t You have to actually... I don't know. Do you have, like, the flip-up sight or something? No, I had the laser sight view where he was, like, looking sideways down the barrel. You gotta hold the trigger down and press down on the directional pad. How do I change this to, uh... There we go, single shot. Yeah, Jesus, that was tough. Figuring out. You know... Most of this shit doesn't cost it. It's a little bit upsetting. But I can't afford either better. You know, let's just do hollow. Let's just, just gonna do hollow. That's what we're doing. Nope, not that either. It's gonna be so good. Compensator. Let's try that for a minute. Flat out fucking iron sights. There's a way to is there a way to zoom in on that one too, or is that I'm thinking of uh PUBG too much. There is, there's a way to hold your breath, like LB or something, hold your breath or something. I know there's something. I think the mistake most people make when it comes, oh shit, games like this is 
they move their gun around. This is what I've noticed about people. And I'm not that good anymore, but I still know I catch myself doing it. They move their gun around to look around. And you really need to be like mm, moving a little bit and like so, uh, scanning with your eyes. Like, look, that guy. I caught him. I'm secured. Bravo. Target. Where did he go? Fuck. Read They're gonna be coming through this cave system again. I guess. Be my guess. Do I guess put my magic to the test? Oh! Who was that? Interesting. Ooh. I can't follow him, can I? It's deep into his fucking territory. They won't let me. <laughs> Even if I want to, it won't let me shoot. There's uh, fucking smoke everywhere. Ah, uh, what a. This is what I'm talking about, man. That's clear as day. It's right there in front of you. I shouldn't miss shots like that. Period. I mean, I, I don't care if I have been up for two or more days. I just shouldn't miss that shot. Iron sights. That, none, none, you know, no excuses. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. The guy just came out of a giant-ass doorway, standing on a giant-ass balcony, nothing in the way. You just can't miss that. You gotta hit that shot. Oh, come on. This guy up on top of me with the SVD is just terrible. I'm actually liking this this view now with this uh laser when you're close quarters. Yeah, I kind of hate the fact that you can see the laser. I mean, we had this conversation. You showed me that they were changing the thing. I remember that you sent me a video. You could see a laser. Come on, guy. Get the fuck. You almost got me killed right there. That you can see a laser in broad daylight. You know, it's... Well, it's part of the game, so you can see where you're aiming. Yeah, but... You know. Kick player dream on for team killing, no. Dream on. I don't know. I don't know if I'm um qualified here. To do what? Or not qualified, but I don't know. What, okay, we captured C. We gotta defend Charlie. Un moment, por favor. Don't fail. Too much descent. Descent? And he just fucking let that guy shoot me, man. 
I was watching the fucking shit the stairs. These things, you That's know. my fault. I should have fully kept myself in the stairs. It's an adjustment. To be back. Shooting at things. Is that guy, like, purposefully killing teammates? Like, just to be back shooting at things is an adjustment for me. No, I don't know, man. That's Remember when I said I changed all my teammates to bright red because it was confusing to me in the beginning, and, and, you know, so... Maybe that's it. Or maybe he is killing on purpose. Who fucking knows? I never did. It was never oh, on. Yeah. It was never on purpose for me, but it happened so often that I I felt I kick. felt desired to. I had the desire, felt the need to change them to really bright color that I recognized, you know. So not only a really bright it's color, but a bright red. So I knew it meant stop. Dude, you don't have a better scope for this. You don't have a better gun for this. Who? Are you watching the scope? Because it shows the camera in like this. Oh, never mind if we lost. Mm. Mm hmm. Yeah, I didn't kill anybody. I did. I had the most defensive kills. Yeah, good shit. Awesome. Even mad. I had zero of everything. I'm terrible. It's because I held that fucking door down in the beginning. And then I was holding the stairs down and... Whoever let it happen. I need to figure out this. Clearly. Fucking twat. That just needs to be true. Yeah, I'm second guessing this scope I have on this thing. Everything I need for this, really. So, and I've got to play care and play on. Yeah, I guess I could upgrade this. Oh uh, uh, no! Don't do this. What would I upgrade? It, it could be upgrade. Uh, it won't let me do anything. I gotta go. I gotta go do combat. I gotta go do combat, man. You know. Man. Yeah. What you know about combat, sirs? Combat. <clears throat> Running towards danger. Running towards danger. Danger is imminent. Shit. Why won't my guy run? The fuck is that good? So shoot me, guy. I didn't. I shot over you. You're lucky. <laughs> <laughs> You're lucky I have such a terrible fucking aim. Well, you know, world hurt. This is where you get the kill from standing at the door. I'm watching the other door. Oh shit, he got through. I was scratching my face. They threw smoke. I don't know what's in here. Oh. Apparently he can see through the dark. Oh, I have a smoke mask to put on. I forgot about that. But I also forgot how to put it on, apparently. Uh, I think it's down or something. No, up, maybe? Left? Jesus! Shit. Wait, this is secure. Do I need to be moving? Allahu Akbar. Hezbollah. Allahu Akbar. 
Have you ever seen the suicide video from PUBG that I've made? The grenade? It's one of the best things you'll, yeah. you'll ever see. Oh, yeah, I think I did. Yeah. It is... It is spectacular. I kill a whole entire house full of people. With a grenade. It's fantastic. <laughs> and I literally yell... Three times. Allah! <laughs> like, I full-blown went through the whole jihadi... Uh, you know. <clears throat> thing there. If we knew what we knew then, now, or now, we knew, you know, oh, you get what I'm saying, right? We would have, me and Matt would have sent it off to, uh, what was that? Sent. How did he, th my crosshairs were on him! Anyway, uh, oh shit. Oh shit! Get back up in here. Fucking A, bro. Get back up in here. Yeah. I'm. Can't. Gotta reload. Get down. There's another one. He's around that corner. Oh, I forgot how to throw grenades. Got him. Watch up top. Watch up top. They went up towards this building Above and I'm us? walking towards. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, I think I cleared below. They're, they're all up here. Yeah, I thought there was one more guy around that rock. There he is. Shit. Where's your shit? Oh, he's all the way on top of the building. I. Is that right? He was way trying to shoot from deep. I'm flanking. Oh, I should not have reset that ammo. Walk slowly. Slow is smooth, smooth is fast. They're definitely gonna try to flank this left. There's no one here but me. There's a lot of open ground, too. But they've. Smoked out by C, so. You yeah, wanna, I'm, I'm, I'm back left, a little bit. You want to follow me? Where you at? I'm making my way and flanking around the left side of C. I see. You. Figure there's bound to be people. Might as well handle it. We got, we got. People on C. I understand. That's why I want to get an angle and then close them. You know what I mean? Can't climb that. Fuck. I'm going close Can't range. Find you. I'm gonna get shot in the back. I'm on C, I gotta get inside. It's gonna totally get rough on here. Yeah, I got a bunch of guys shot. Let's jump this way a little bit. Basically, going straight towards the, stairs on the, the front door. I don't have the greatest angle. But I, I see a damn thing in here. Trying, because it pops smoke. Wait, are we losing it? Yeah. What do you need? Tell me what you need. I got one. Got him. Got one of them. Like, do you need me to be in there? Got to be another one. Made or what? I definitely got guys to my right, by the way. As soon as I come out of here and move to the right, there's jihadists. 
We're the jihadists, I think. Uh, well, whatever. I don't care. The point is, if I walk forward and move to the right of these rocks to the pipe, yeah, there's guys back here. What's that green smoke about? Uh, I don't know where you're at, so... Ugh, I don't like any of this. I'm moving towards D. Are those people? Or mannequins? What the fuck? Are they paintings? Like, what the That's deeply confusing. You can all laugh at me if you'd like. Feel free. <laughs> it's just... I'm moving on D. Front door. Oh, 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 oh. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh shit, somebody's shooting at me from over there. Come on, stick your fucking head back out there, you clunt. Oh no, we aren't the jihadists. Uh, bro, they were speaking, you know, like that's what I was saying. They were, yeah, they were speaking a language that I wasn't, uh, I wasn't being like, you know, snatchy or racist or anything. Sound like they were saying jihad states. <clears throat> I don't know why that took so many shots, but it did. I went from where, bro? Oh shit. I may be in trouble, man. Well, yeah. In trouble. I mean. Yeah, that's the best I got for you. I really, bro, you're not even trying to. Uh... I gotta, I gotta, I'd like to know where your, your location. To come and try to rescue me at this point is. Son of a bitch. Oh, here. shit, I was, I was inside the building. Come on. Come on. Oh, he heard you. Oh, he's playing cat and mouse with you. There he is. I have a partner, so you didn't realize. We're losing. Yeah, he's up there behind you. Yeah. I think we got guys in there. They're blocked. Good shit. Hello? Hello? The Americans are here! Fuck the Americans. Don't you want to kill Americans? Well, hell yeah, boy. Come on, give me that pussy. Oh, what? The cross is on him. Oh, he, oh, he bitched out and ran away. I might blew him to smithereens. Oh! Oh, you crack with the shotgun! He almost had me there, too. 
Dude, they blew up that thing with a grenade. He didn't even have to go in and plant it. Well, he just threw a grenade on it. Time to blow up my hand. Fucking MG42, it's like a fucking that German buzzsaw machine. Back in World War Two. <sighs> Follow this marine right here. Get his back. Reloading. I swear to God, there's a way to stabilize shots. I just don't know. Holy shit! There's a lot of them. Oh, f you know, <laughs> I got myself in that mess. That was where they spawned. I got 36 kills, nice. Does this guy drop a gun? Just... Alright, here we go. Fuck you! AMERICA! Fuck yeah! God, I wish it would let me do that. This is much more dangerous. Was there a guy there? See a guy? See a guy's head? Yeah. Watch this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Careful, I saw two going down Bakalaka Daka Street. Dirk, Dirk, stand. <laughs> Dirk, Dirk, and Jihad. Dirk, 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 Dirk. For Hezbollah. <laughs> For Bosnia. Bosnia. It's an old tour there. And look, Bosnia nothing like a little, little, nothing like a little ethnic cleansing, you know? <laughs> Bitch. Fucker almost got me. No, he's trying to pick up. The dude's trying to pick up a grenade launcher. He got it too. One of our teammates. He's got like an AT4 or something. Go ahead, use that. Ah. How do you stabilize the? F I know there's a way. How do you fire your grenades? Forget that for right now. Hold in breath. I know there's a way to do it, just like in every other game. I seem to have forgotten. Bitch. I just rocked them bitches. Bang! I'm, dude, I'm on fire right now. I'm playing well. Bro, this game has always been a good game. I, you know, because it's one of these games that, look, the thing is, right? If you have good eye hand, I mean good eye hand coordination, right? You're a quick guy. It's not like Call of Duty or or Halo where they take they can sponge like 870 
thousand rounds. If you shoot somebody in the face in this game, uh, they die. Which is it's a nice change of pace. So I see it. It's definitely a dude up here causing trouble. I just don't know if it's one of ours. Yeah, no, I'll never know. I guess we go all the way around. This is bullshit. He won't jump or climb the right way, but come on, I need to I need up there. I need to know if this is friend or foe, guys. Fucking bullshit, yo! I swear to god there's a dude up in this Ah, oh, that's a good guy. Yo, I do know there's a way to hold your breath. I just, I don't know. I don't care anymore. They're going all around the backside of that building. Yeah, that's where I'm at. Yeah, well, I mean, like, literally six of them just ran around the, the full flank backside of the building. I got a couple guys with me up here. We've been holding this door down. Oh, I got that one. Fucking A. Shit. Probably gonna be running How do you change your sidearm? Uh, uh, alright, well, why? Same way, you just sweat. Anyway, uh, you know. Yeah, man. Yo, I got the no last. Worries, I'm pretty sure I got this last kill. I don't know if they show the last kill, but I shot this guy in the I head. Kill, That's because you're the right, fucking be man, up. Danny. There's five people viewing this right now, watching you be a beast, bro. Look at you, most defensive kills. Beast! <laughs> alright, I gotta go to bed, though. I gotta get up. 9.30. Get Lucy ready. She gotta get her hair done tomorrow. Oh. Had fun, man. We can get back on this. This has always been... Jump on uh, Ghost Recon. This is, I mean, like I said, you know, I like both. Uh, this is always a fun game because, you know, again, just like Ghost Recon, you shoot somebody, they die in this game. You know, that's a plus. So. I guess <clears> throat> throat> if you're out, I guess I'll be out. Unless yeah, I can I'm find somebody else to play with. So, there's Danelle. He's playing golf. I'm tempted to ask him where he dis stood me up to yesterday. <laughs> all right, I'll catch you later. All right, all right. Get the fuck out already. I'm right. tired of hearing it. Now, there's six viewers and you're leaving. Oh, my God. You're killing me, smalls, huh? Hello, six viewers. Welcome to the show. Where I aim poorly, I kill less, and uh, occasionally I put on one hell of a fucking show. <laughs> right now, what I'm going to show you is an ad that I must run or I'll never make any money.
sorry about that. We just stepped away. Uh, ads running anyway. If anybody's there that wants to chat and has any opinion on what they want me to play, if they want me to keep playing this, that's fine. I'll keep playing this. Um, but also, keep in mind, there's... Uh, I've got a couple of players that are playing, a couple of friends that are playing golf. PGA Tour 2K21. I can always play tennis. I've got a couple of tennis games that I'm good at. Um, so, you know, if you have a preference, I am here to listen. You know, um, the customer is always right, right? I mean, <laughs> uh, but nobody really does seem to ever truly want to engage in conversation here with me, which is a little disappointing, I'm not going to lie, but as long as you're here, it's fine. But rather you be here and not talking than not here and not talking. Yeah, obviously. <clears throat> so... Uh, I guess I'll keep doing this and try to, like, knock the rust off. There's definitely rust. I mean, 100% rust going on here. No doubt about it. Hmm. For what I you <clears throat> No requests. Uh, nobody took the advisor slide yet. You know, I think we don't need this for stats. That's going to go. That's, that's got to go. You know, uh, we may not even really need this, right? Then we come back here, right? And then we can take this gun and we can put a. Alright, well, we gotta, we gotta play right now. When, in a minute, though, we'll put maybe a different scope on or something. You know, su suppressor, maybe. Even. I mean, nobody wants to talk, huh? Ooh. Oh, it's bad news, Leroy Brown, eh? Fucking shooting me with an RPG, motherfucker! Really? Fucking really. Unreal. Meanwhile, Cross town. Cover me. 
Yo! When you're aimed right at somebody... Bullshit, man. First of all, I guess. Presser. America fuck <laughs> Who really knows, you know? There's the good, there's the bad, there's the ugly. He won't come, most likely. But he's worth the invite. He's a good friend, and an even better player. When you have good friends like these, and they're even better at games, it's important you invite them to come close. Sorry, I'll stop soon. Okay, they're coming back now. Good luck, guys. Stay in now. Alright, time to move. Let's go. Don't be scared. Starting to really not love this idea here. It's gotta be a better idea. This one here. Ah! Yep, frick. Oh my god, no, I No, Oh my god, no. Just, you know. Come on, no. What do you do now? I mean, that's wild. Eh. That's terrifying. Terrible, terrifying, you know It's all bad. Right. Try it at boss, right? Steady, steady, she goes, right? You know, that should really do it. Uh, we can put a laser on it, but anyway. this is laser really do it for saving that line. Eh, uh, where is this here? I mean, I guess we can do it with uh, too much money. Wow. Fuck it, then, eh? Uh, so, uh, quick draws, do it. There you go. Now we disappointed. That hamster is not, you know, joining us. I mean, you know, maybe it's possible. Okay, it's entirely possible. I'm always like, spoiling hamsters. Right? Yeah. 
so, you know, generally speaking, but, uh, would prefer it if he did. But you know, uh, them's the things that they are. You know, them's is what they, what they is, you know. So. Let's go. <clears throat> okay, I don't want this. How do I turn this shit off? Oh, there we go. Fuck this poor shooting from her. Oh, look at you, huh? Oh fuck it. Come on Andrew, what are you doing? That's fucking awful man. God damn you're so fucking terrible right now. Huh? And see guys, like, look, that's what makes it tough. Like, like, am I gonna lie and say that I'm playing great right now? No, I'm playing fucking terrible. Like, it's pretty fucking obvious, isn't it? I'm just a joke right now, you know. But, same thing, okay? Here's the bottom line of it, right? I mean, you know. <clears throat> partner, good partner. Someone like, uh, like Hamster comes, you know, change things, and my brother, you know, my brother, my brother do a little better that way, you know what I mean? Like we could, uh, you know, figure some things out, you know, you never know what's going to happen when, when you add the right partner. That's so simple, simple math like that, like that, you know, that's kind of just how it is, it's, uh, how it is, how it goes, you know, so, yeah, but, uh, you know, do what you do. It's on him thing now, right now. So, well, hello. Who's this now? Mm. Save me, please. What do you need saving from?
from Are you baiting me? From Weta Wallet. I feel like you're trying to bait me into doing like get me to say something I shouldn't say. I like, what does that even mean? Weta 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 did You're gonna have to tell me what, what exactly that is. What the fuck, Andrew? Here we go again with this shit shooting. It's fucking garbage. Better. Oh? Well, that is, in this day and age, a slightly politically incorrect word, isn't it? But, uh, you know, that's fine. And why do you need saving from, uh, this mentally impaired? Who is mentally impaired? The people you're playing with. I am needed. I uh, I am indeed a white Aryan man. Come on, dude. So you're just in here trying to troll me in my room? Then that's what's what's what. I mean. Like that's what's fun for you. Alpha's taken. They just took Alpha. Okay, what's well, fine? You love insurgency. That's nice. So... I'm terrible at it, as you can see. So I don't know how I could help. <clears throat> no more trolls. I don't, I mean, my dude, you just said you're a white Aryan. <laughs> I mean, I run a stream. And, you know, not for nothing, but like, I, you believe what you believe, that's fine. But, you know, I don't necessarily believe in superior races or anything, and, and uh, I try to keep it just non. I try to keep it as non-political in here as possible. Anyway, to be frank, you know, just have fun, play games, have a good time. I think that's sort of in my mission statement. If you read, read the opening profile thing there. So, <clears throat> now I'm anyway just getting back into the swing of things. I haven't played this game in a very long time, but as you can see, I'm extraordinarily sloppy. So. I have it on PlayStation. Oh, okay. I don't own a PlayStation, so actually, I'm really in a bad way. <laughs> this is not me asking, but at some point soon, I'm going to have to raise money for a number of things. Uh, like, I definitely am going to need a. Hold on a second. I want that. I want the Alpha. Okay. 
you know, let's go with this. Um, <clears throat> just say, uh, right. I'm gonna need a uh, <laughs> either a new computer, so like a gaming computer. I'm gonna have to buy, or I'm gonna have to buy a new Xbox because. I have the One X, and that's getting old to the point where, you know, it's basically no, no bueno. Anymore. You know, they won't. Um, the games they're making, the the brand new games they're making, just won't won't have it. You know, so that's a problem. Uh, it's one of the one of the problems. You know, <laughs> so. Uh, I should probably start with a, like a capture card. I could really use a capture card. There's no reason why for that. Um, instead of I'm using the mirror app and and just uh, the mirror app and um, hold on a second. It's much better looking than the other one, by the way. Yeah. Um, uh, just Twitch Studio, so. <clears throat> There's quite a number of things like, you know, uh, oh wow, I, I still got room too. Let's grab a play carrier then. Sure. Still got a point. What do I want to use it for? Uh, I mean, the truth is, is there's really uh, that flash hide. Um, yeah, my situation has continued to get worse. I mean, I used to be, to be doing okay, and I, I injured my neck really badly. Uh, C4, 5, 5, 6, 6, 7, all of them were badly herniated, and two of them were badly rubbing on nerves. I've already had 5, 6 replaced. I still need to have 6, 7 replaced, and... And you know, with spinal injuries, they really don't get better, they only get worse, so at some point, I'm sure 4 or 5 is going to be more of a problem as well. So, I, I, you know, uh, and I just noticed some really terrible things already, like, not sending, uh, it affects, it even affects stuff like this, my video games, because it doesn't send the proper signals to my, from my brain to my hands anymore. I used to be a very good athlete, used to be a golfer. Um, so, I guess the moral story there is, if you're out there listening, take care of your neck, you know what I mean? Uh, your spine is, you know, so important. <laughs> it's what connects your brain to the rest of you and tells your body what to do, so. <laughs> you know, I don't think you'd believe me if I told you, bro. I mean, I, I'm happy, I will tell you, I'd be happy to tell you, but most people... Uh, look on it with a little suspicion when I tell them. So, all right. Um, when I was about 17 years old, uh, I had like really heavy weighted golf club. As I told you before, I was a very good golfer. Actually, that was sort of one like my goal in life. I wanted to be a pro golfer, and. Um, <clears throat> I decided that I would swing it like a baseball bat in my bedroom, and uh, I was about to hit my two thousand dollars area. So I check swung, being a good athlete, I check swung it, um, and I tore my labrum in my left shoulder, um, and I didn't work out as much. I didn't play golf as much for a little while. Like, well, I kept playing golf to be honest. It was during the middle of golf season, and I didn't want to let my high school team down. But, uh, then I let it rest for a little while, and I, I felt like the shoulder was, was getting better, you know, um, that's good. But, uh, I was playing a tournament, a junior tournament in the area, and, uh, I barely, on the first tee, I mean, I barely, barely, barely missed the fairway. I was, like, maybe, maybe three feet into the rough, right? And I was in an old divot. And the old divot was only, you know, and I'm trying to, I'll, I'll show you exactly if I can. I mean, I don't know where, where you see, like, you know. It was only about literally that long still, right? 
and it was only the width of the golf ball. Okay? And literally half the depth of the golf ball. So I've got a ball that's just sitting in, in a hole halfway down, right? And on either side, they had just held a qualifier there at that golf course for like uh, the U.S. Amateur or Mid-Am or something like that, right? A big USGA event, right? And so the rough was all grown up and I had a, a lot of, like a big tuft of rough behind where, I, where the ball was and a big tuft of rough in front of where the ball was. And I looked at it, and I said to myself, man, you know, it, well, shot, sorry, I shot my teammate. Was there. I said, man, you know, Andrew, this is the kind of shot you can really hurt yourself on. Because I basically had a stab that directly down on it. It only had, like, 94 yards to the green, right? So I hit my sand wedge, and I actually just flailed at it as hard as I could, right? And sure enough, uh, I thought... At worst, I would re-injure my shoulder, you know? But what ended up happening was my shoulder was maybe not fully healthy yet anyway. And my body looked for a different power source. And I guess it looked for it in my neck. And when I hit the ball, I felt everything proceed forward except for my neck. It felt like my neck stayed behind and there was this tearing, snapping sound, you know? And, um... It burned right away, and uh, I thought, like, I was young, and I thought that maybe I had torn, like, you know, oh, it's just no big deal, I tore a muscle, you know, uh, it'll heal, right? But in reality, what I had done was I had herniated three discs, uh, two of which I had herniated really badly, which would get worse over time and start rubbing on the nerve and you know the nerve stems in my spine and uh, I've had one of them replaced since then um, and I still need to have the other one replaced and who knows what will happen with the third one because like I said spine injuries don't really ever get better they tend to only get worse or stay the same so that's the story I mean there you go the, you know a lot of people don't believe you can do that playing golf, but if you've ever seen six to eight inch rough, and if you know that kind of lie, you know, if you ever played golf, you know that kind of lie, you've got to drop the club straight down on it just to get it, you know, as hard as you can, just to get it to go 90 yards, you know. By the way, I hit it to eight feet, in case anybody cares, and made birdie, but I also just lost every single viewer here for some reason. How about that? There were like seven or eight people in the other tip. And you've stopped talking, so. <laughs> How about that? Guess I should have not told the story. That's, that's fine. <clears throat> so yeah, I mean, in case you don't believe me, you can. Look, I'll tell you exactly because it's very rare. Still, I had sort of an experimental disc put in. Uh, you can feel free to look it up. Uh, it's called the Moby C. The M O B I dash C. C stands for cervical spine. That's your neck. So, you know, um, that's the disc I had them put in. Um, so, you'll know you looked that up, you know, that's not just common knowledge. So, you know, uh, I think if you look hard enough, I don't know if you can still see the scar or not there, where they went through my, my throat. Sort of, they tucked past your carotid artery. Get back in there. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, search whatever you want. <laughs> I thought you said you weren't going to troll.
Not so much for that, huh? I'm not. <laughs> this feels like bait again. So was eating kind of a problem? I mean, um, why? Why would, uh, you know. So, the, the problem was... Oh, right. Through the throat, yeah. So, for about... It's actually, it's actually, um, I had my tonsils taken out when I was younger, like, and it wasn't as bad as that, to be perfectly honest. Um, it was like having a pretty bad sore throat for about a week and a half, um, because it's your spine, and they're replacing discs, and they didn't go through the back, there's no real muscles to recover, so the recovery time was very, you know, one sort of you know, your throat is healed up, uh, you know, like, retain as, you know, as you can see, retain a pretty awesome amount of motion. Doctors are still impressed to this day, I tell them, you know, I had this replacement, and, you know, that's what this does. So, when I searched for a disc, I had very specific things in mind, because I knew I never wanted screws in my body if I could have a choice about it, you know. And so I was looking for discs that didn't use screws, you know, to anchor into a bone. And what this does is it has, like, little uh, notches, you look at it, uh, like descending notches. And so it slides onto, and then what they do is they'll, they'll sort of uh, scuff up your bone and let the bone grow around those notches. And there's like a zero friction surface between the two like it's it's like a sandwich and and you know it's zero friction so you keep full range of motion yeah I mean I you know again um I had one of the best surgeons around. I mean, one of the two, I believe, best neurosurgeons. And that's, by the way, important, too. I mean, I went to a neurosurgeon, a brain surgeon, to have this done. Um, he was one of the two or three best brain surgeons in the state that I live in. Um, so, you know, they might have, for your counselor, used, like, a standard wedge. Basically, it looks like a doorstop, you know, something like, like, well, actually, like, I guess it's backwards, like this, right? So, like, and what it is, is have, uh, um, uh, brackets, you know, uh, and so they would drill into your, uh, vertebrae on the top and the bottom, and screw, like, well, screw it in, and they, those, that's what would anchor it, you know, all right. So, you know, that's what's a normal one. A normal one's basically just a door wedge anchored by screws on uh, either side of the disc. You know, they, they screw into your vertebrae, which is what I didn't want. Right. So. And tip, I don't know, typically I think they go through the back. So they do go through your neck muscles, like the back of your neck with uh, some of those, those disc type replacements. So, you know. But I knew what I wanted. I researched real hard. You know what I mean? Like, it was, it's still rare to this day. There's still only, like, maybe 70 or 80,000 of them in, in the entire world. And, uh... We shot him. I shot him, too. Right, yeah. But anyway, there's still only 70 or 80,000 in the entire world. So, uh, it's... I'm kind of like an experiment. <laughs> you know. But, like I said, and this is what really sucks, the neurosurgeon, I don't know if, you, if you're still there, and I told him we should do 5, 6, and 6, 7 at the same time. Those were really both bad, you know? And uh, he agreed. And then, literally, okay, 
two days before the surgery is supposed to happen. I come in for like that pre-surgery checkup that you always have. And he tells me he's doing one. And I'm like, we, we talked about doing two. We always talked about doing two. What the fuck? You know. And he's like, well, you know, I could call and argue with the insurance company if you want me to. But you'll have to wait probably another three months in the pain that you're in. You know. I never wanted to, like, eh, snatch the life out of anybody, you know, in my life more than that met yet. And just terrible, you know? Who says that? What the fuck, man? It's what we talked about the whole time. Now, you going back on it? Like, I honestly got... What the, I mean... Oh... I don't even know how much longer I can play if it's gonna be like this to be perfectly honest. Same. It's the same as this. Why? Did you hear what I said, by the way, about the surgeon and how we I'd always discuss doing both levels and he dicked me down about doing both levels? He only did the one. And that one's the, the one that should have been done at the same time is gonna give me trouble now. Yeah, bro. I mean, if you're watching, look. Look, it's the same. The show 412. All normal letters and numbers. Nothing, nothing special. <clears throat> so. Oh, uh, well. So uh, the five, six, and six, seven were both really pretty bad, and so every time I went in there, I had said I want to have them both done. You know, at the same time, you know. And he was, every time, he agreed with me. Every single time, right? Until two or three days before the surgery, you have that one pre-surgery, you know, checkup that the doctor wants to do. Uh, okay. No, I don't think it worked, dude. Um. Yeah, I don't... Listen, I don't enjoy it either, but that didn't work for whatever reason, so... Maybe it's because I'm already in a party, I don't know, I mean... Leave this one. Go ahead. I mean, you could try it. You're welcome to you're welcome to try again. Go ahead. We'll see if it works this time. You know. I hope.
Ah, oh, shit. God damn it. One more. That worked when I accidentally messed it up. Wait, can you hear me or no? God damn it. It worked that time and I accidentally double clicked something. Just one more. I don't know why I can't hear you. Uh. Uh, you can hear, but I can't hear you. That'd be a problem, I can't hear you though. So. But anyway, like I was saying, that pre-surgery checkup, like a, like two days, three days before the surgery, and every time we had agreed, you know, we'd do both levels, he said, so we'll do the 5-6, just the 5-6, you know, right? And, uh, Yes, yeah, it on the. It says I'm not even in a party there. So, I, but um, he said oh, I'm only do, we're going to do the one, and I, I, you know, I made quite a fuss about it, right? And uh, he's like, well, you know, I can argue with the insurance company if you'd like, uh, but or I see you guys here. I'm on. Don't know why I can't hear you. Party options. I don't know what's going on. What? All right. Well, I don't know why I can't hear you guys, but uh, it doesn't matter. You can keep sending them. That doesn't really. Hold on. Try it. Try talking now. No, it's not working. Why it's not working? Should be. Yeah, I don't think it matters how many you guys send me. You know. Uh. I think you're gonna have to try to send it through the Xbox itself, to be perfectly honest. I mean, again, I mean, I'm here. I mean, story's almost over anyway, but it, I mean, we'll figure it out. Uh, the, the point is, like I said, he said well, we, I can argue with the insurance company, but then, you know, it'll probably take another three months or whatever, and I was in absolute fucking agony with the nerve that, you know, the pinched nerve. So, of course, I'm going to say, let's just do the one, and then I did a lot of rehab. I came back later to him and asked him if he do the other one. He said, no. Like, you like a prick, you know. So, whatever. You know what I mean? That's like... Oh, there you go. There we go. Okay. There. Can you hear me now? I can hear you, yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, typing through Xbox is just super, super annoying. Nice, I feel you. Slow. Um, so, yeah. Did you get the end of that? Did you, did you catch that? I didn't hear shit. <clears throat> so yeah, so the checkup, like that pre-surgery checkup, like two or three days before the surgery, right? And every single time we talk about doing both levels, you know, the five, six, and six, seven. Get there, he says he's only gonna do the one, the, the uh, five, six. It's the worst of the two, uh, even though they're both really bad. I argue. He goes, well, 
I can argue with the insurance company if you want me to, but you know, that might take another three months. Well, I'm in fucking agony, by the way. So, I'm not waiting, you know. Any, any relief, I'm taking. So, he knows that, too. So then, some... A couple years later, I'd done a lot of rehab. I also had a shoulder surgery, you know. And I went back to him to get the other one done, and he's like, you know, I can't just replace your whole fucking spine. I've never wanted to, like, kill somebody more in my life. I, I, yeah, I you know, I, I hate to say that. It's not, you know, but, uh, it's the truth. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so. I feel the, uh, power of anger consume me every day. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Let's not talk about it. Yeah, I, I'd rather not, yeah. I mean, <laughs> you, based on what you said earlier, yeah, it's not a conversation we're going to get into, so. Wait, what did I say earlier? Nah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, okay. <laughs> So, yeah. Something odd. I have more headshots on my alt account than I do on this account. This is my man. On your alt account yeah. than you do on this account? Yeah. Uh, my alt account's on the party. And political. So, uh... What do you... I guess I would ask then, what do you use it for? You know? Daisy. So you're taking headshots deliberately if it's zombies, anyway. Um, I uh, well, no, with the headshots, I was talking about Rainbow, but DayZ is a different story. DayZ, I use it for um, things. I guess. Yeah. I guess what I meant to say more than anything, like, is is this? So, like, if you take it really seriously on your primary account or whatever, you know what I mean? And uh, mm. you know, you're trying to do like the absolute hardest stuff or. Or what, and and then you kind of screw around a little bit because you have that secondary account. You may be obviously more relaxed and more capable, and you know you have more headshots. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. Uh, obviously, that's why I was asking you what you do with it. I, if you look at it that way, that's just kind of common sense. But uh, so let's say I made an alternative Discord and alternative account, which is the impolitical one, so I could get on this disc or Daisy server that I'm banned on. Oh my man, it's a great server, just a lot of admin abuse. Okay. Well, I don't. I haven't had to ban anyone from any of my stuff, but I hope this. You won't. I hope you're not gonna. You know. I know what you're saying. Yeah. Would not like to start now. I wouldn't, you know. I, but you know, also, uh, and again, you said what you said, so I don't know why. Whatever, it could have been anything. But I got banned like three times the other day. I was trying to. I've been. I've been off for a while. Like I hadn't been streaming, you know. And um, I decided I wanted to get back into it. And to get back into it, sort of slowly, I started to. You Lucky know. Ozzy. Oh my god, he just didn't kill. I don't know, I don't know, but anyway. <laughs> uh, Locked my friend? I started to go in rooms and talk, and it, it amazes me in this day and age how quickly people will just, just ban you. Do not pass go, do not click turn all, just, you know, go straight to being banned. Um,. And for, oh, you call me a stupid man? You're getting banned. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even have to be It doesn't even have to be a derogatory thing. It just has to not be in line with their message, and not even give you a chance to explain yourself. They don't care. Immediately, you're banned. Like I could say, like you know, in a feminist room nowadays, and I, uh, whatever. Just they're a little over the rails, if we're being honest. Uh, you know, that it's not exactly like men. Ha and that's why I say, like, the draft. I talk about the draft, for starters. And then I talk about how fathers, you know, and as far as when I was growing up and, and the way they raise their sons, they're not. it's not overly pleasant. Young men are t treated as 
mostly disposable. They send them off to war to die. Fathers don't treat them, you know, they teach them basically the world doesn't give a shit about you. Ho hum. Oh, you have a problem? Deal with it, you know. And, you know, just because that doesn't fit their idea of, fe like, what feminine, you know what I mean? Oh, no, it's got to be all about women, you know, or whatever. Mm hmm. I got banned from three, and it wasn't. I don't like I said. I don't know if that was the exact scenario. I know that it, I was in a room where something like that happened, but I got banned from three rooms that one day, and it, it's so odd because it's like I said. It's not even like a warning. No warnings, just uh, you know. So like I said, oh, what, you know, you watch, watch out. You're you're getting there. You know what I mean? No, nope, just banned pops up on the screen. <laughs> and you're like, why? I what? <laughs> or it's normally when you prove a lot of points. Yeah, they don't. Oh, point. they don't like right. They don't like common sense. That's for sure. You start making sense. Uh, that's no good. Resist the woke. So, you know, and I, I, the problem that I really have with it, I'll be really honest with you. And this is something I've, I'll, I'll say on my stream. I'm not afraid to say it. Like it's fine. Is that, uh, I don't know how old you are, but they call my generation the selfish generation, which is kind of funny. To if me. I told you, you would not believe me, literally. Hey, okay, well, anyway, I mean, they, 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 yeah, <laughs> okay. They call my generation the selfish <laughs> generation, you know. Uh, maybe that's true, maybe it's not, I really don't know, but. Look, we were the ones that basically said, like, I don't care. Uh, most of my generation didn't give a shit. Like, what you do with your body is your business, so on and so forth, you know what I mean? Uh, mm -hmm. As long as you don't force your opinions and your ideology on us, go live your life. And somehow, uh, <laughs> it doesn't matter. You know, somehow that they just ignored our gen my generation altogether and the world is spiraling now. Clearly. I mean, it's not even funny. Oh my god, my ass. I think our team's getting fucked. Are you, are you on the Nope. Just got shot right in the door. Three guys walked in. So, yeah. I mean... And that's, that's how I kind of feel about that. I feel like our generation was finally making a little bit of progress there with not hating everyone anyway, you know, and, and being more acceptance, but not, now you gotta, no, now it's not okay, it's not okay, right, it's not okay to, it's not even okay now to be just accepting, you have to like be a fucking cheerleader for everyone now, it's, what? No. Oh, you're fat? I love you. Right. <clears throat> I don't get, it's, yeah, it's a backwards world now, dude, I, I don't get it, I mean, it's my, it's whatever. Well, I said I'm a, a millennial, so uh, uh, you know that that that's definitely a certain early thirties, late twenties. Actually, Maybe. I'm I'm sort of an elder millennial, so mid thirties, yeah. Mid thirties. Yeah. I mean, my mom's thirty-one. Your mom's thirty-one. So, yeah. Yeah. So I'm older than your mom. There you go. Way to make me feel old. That. That no. We have to do is insult people and you'll have a great day. Insult people and have a I'm great day? I'm actually not even that rude. <laughs> I'm not really not, I just say shit. It's weird, like I said, man, certain people are so. They just have no. It's so weird to me. They have humor. Less than no. less than zero patience and absolute zero tolerance. Like I've been time banned before. Hold on, I gotta go scream the N word at somebody in game. Nah. <laughs> I got team guild. Deeply uncomfortable. Just a joke. Uh, anyway, yeah. I mean, <clears throat> I see some like they're all team killing. There's a girl. I uh, so I she's a musician, right? Like I just said, indecisive, and she's so neurotic. 
that she banned me for, for saying she was indecisive. Not like a permanent ban, like a time ban, you know? Like 15 minutes or something. Just for saying indecisive. What the fuck? Like... <laughs> um, on a Discord server, there's this guy that, uh... I was playing on a different team just for a little That's while. I think I just got team kill. I'm fucking... Yeah. <laughs> it happens. But, uh, I was playing on a DayZ server, and I switched teams, and I, I come back, somebody says something about me getting team killed, but I was on the other team, so I wasn't being team killed. Uh, the leader of the, I don't even know what he was, I'll be honest. He said that he, he was going to put me on leave for just a little while, and I said, fuck off. And he got so pissed off about I'm good. I'm good. Doing coke. Yup. Snorting lines. Yup. Exactly. I'm doing. Nah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> nah. But it does amaze me. You're right. I mean, it's uh, the little things, the tiniest little word. As if a word you that fuck off trigger. Right now. Fuck. Me? No. Uh, oh, what they do? Yeah, that's exactly how, right. Fuck off. Right. Something that they don't like that you couldn't maybe even possibly know that they don't like. You know what I mean? And it's immediately, go fuck yourself, fuck off your bitch. Yeah. That's exactly right. That's how it goes. What, what, what kind of world is that? Bizarro. I may actually have the screenshots still. I don't know. Uh, screenshots? I mean, this was only in, like, March or April. Yeah, I normally screenshot stupidity. Oh, uh, okay. Right. Of conversations we had that with people that are ignorant. Yeah, I got you. <laughs> I feel you. Automobile Roadmaster. Classic Cars. Ryan Lorem. Why am I reading this? I don't know. This is Waco. I am inside of Waco. I oh, you said you were going to uh, search for if you had any uh, of those conversations. Ah, uh, no, not right now. A little bit later on. I'm tired. I'm just gonna play a few rounds of this. Maybe go to sleep. Maybe not. I don't know. I think this might be my last one because I'm playing bad. And, uh. It is what it is. I've been up for. Too long. Fuck you, Ash! Ugh! Motherfucker. I'm stuck. I'm gonna die. Please don't. I'm up here with two of my teammates. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I gotta stop doing this to myself. And I'm streaming, and in an effort to try to get the, get, you know, get the attention of whoever, you know, like get more followers, even whatever, you know, I end up staying up for three days at a time sometimes, you know. And, yeah, I'm not... Personally, I say whatever you do, just make sure it's fun, don't really worry about the numbers within your stream, don't worry about the viewers. Just uh, look occasionally for comments, yada yada, because I mean, I used to stream a whole lot, but uh, that account got banned. Let's not talk about that either. <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about that. Uh, but uh, but, I was so, doing good. Almost affiliate. I uh, see. I am an I I made affiliate. Um, I know, with the ads. And yeah. Whatnot. But uh, I don't know. I just burnt out. Like, I guess the story would be. May 15th, 2020, my father died of, of a widowmaker, a massive heart attack. Um, he was 65. And we had, most of our lives been, had not a great relationship, but in the last like three years we really did. So that really took a lot out of me. And then that new year, 
right out, you know, right as the year changed, 2021, January, my, my grandmother died, my last living grandparent. And then uh, a few months after that, in early summer, I, a uh, 16-year-old Karen Terry that I had, my dog, died. I, I kind of sort of held him as he died. Uh, what was it? Uh, was what was what what he die of or? Yeah, I don't know. He just he just got sick, and and within a week he was gone. I mean, I I, I took him to the vet. They said his kidneys were starting to fail. Um, they really didn't know why. So uh, the only thing that I could have done differently was send him to like this really special type of place. But if I that's like ten grand that I don't have. <laughs> And I love the. Don't get me wrong. I would do if I had it, right? Yeah, I would have done it in a, in a, in half of a mills. You know what I mean? It wouldn't even have been mm-hmm. if I had that to do. I, it would not even have been in question. Uh, just didn't have it. Uh, so I did what little I could, uh, and I held him as he died. And there's, you know, that sort of sent me. I needed to, sort of throw myself into something, you know, big time. Um, and one of my friends suggested this, or not this, but well, streaming, not this specific game, just streaming, <laughs> right, right, right. Just to be clear, streaming in general, and you know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. So, what? I'm trying to remember when was Waco Siege. Waco Siege was in uh, yeah. ninety two, one ninety one. No, ninety two. I think. See, no, Timothy McVeigh got arrested uh, in 1991 because of the Oklahoma City bombing. Right. So I'm just trying to think, and then he got killed in 95. So, here's what I, I mean, uh, and whatever, I just happen to know about this stuff because I'm big time on military type things and, you know, any attack on the country, I consider, you know, whatever. Oh my so. fucking god. But, I'm clipping that. Uh, I'm pretty sure McVeigh was 92. Then, in 93, right, uh, was the first attempt that Al-Qaeda made to try to blow up the World Trade Centers with a truck bomb, um, uh, in the garage. Um, uh, in 93, we were in Mogadishu, that whole Black Hawk Down situation. Um, yeah, so I, I mean, I don't know what, what specifically you're looking for, oh, I could God, probably... I mean, fuck I, was, I don't even know what I was thinking, I'm so out of it right now. It was April 19th, 1995, what am I thinking of? I don't know, I was... Waco is what you were trying to figure out. What year? Yeah. I'm pretty sure the Waco was '92. I mean, I I might be wrong. It's easy enough to look up. You could always ask that dumb uh, Siri. <laughs> hey Siri, are you gonna be smart today? I don't understand the question. Hey Siri, you're pretty dumb for a smartphone. That's not very nice. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking about, but I know something was in 1991. I don't know exactly. Uh, well, I, I I can tell you what was in 1991. I if you, mm-hmm. if you believe me or not, it was the, yeah, the it was the first Gulf War. In 1991 was the first uh, Iraq War. It was the first Gulf War. Where mm. Saddam Hussein invaded Kuwait, was trying to steal their uh, oil reserves, and we, we went and stomped the mud hole in them. That's actually what started, by the way, Osama, Osama bin Laden offered to defend them and had been fighting against the Germans in Afghanistan. Or not Germans, I'm sorry, Russians. Uh, Russians? Yeah. And uh, was pissed off that they decided to let us help instead of him. <laughs> That's that started his whole vendetta against us. How ironic! My friend Saddam Hussein was kind of a good man. You know why? 
he executed you know, everybody who opposed him. Can I tell you something? A great authority. And I've said this before on the stream, so I'm really not afraid to say it, you know. Here's the thing. Everybody hates dictators, okay? And I'm not saying that's right or wrong to be brutal, right? But there was a lot less terrorism and a lot more stability in that part of the world when he was in power. Oh, yeah. Such is the nature of people like that. I mean, they keep people in line. They, they, I mean, whatever. You know, not my business. I have a few favorite dictators in mind. Yeah, and, uh, you know. <laughs> Stalin was the worst. Oh, yeah, and then uh, people say Hitler, six million... Yada, yada. Stalin killed 20 million of his own people, for Christ's sakes. I mean... Yeah, and then the Holodomor. It was... If you know anything about that. The Holodomor? Yeah. He was... I know he was preparing. I, I know he killed tw about 20 million of his own people, and I know he was actively preparing to kill Jewish people, just like Hitler, when he passed. He is making you know, plans. something interesting about a lot of the communistic dictators? They, every single one of them, hated homosexuals. Okay. Stalin, Che Guevara, um, Fidel Castro. Who else? Karl Marx. Oh. Karl Marx. Okay. I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, right, I don't know I, what I'm getting at. If I there's know what I'm a, about, right, I, I know what I'm getting at. Right, if there's a moral to that story, you might want to right, share it. With you. <laughs> Probably not for the best. I mean, you know, like I said to you before, as long as they don't, as long as people don't try to shove their ideology in my face and try to make me, I don't really care what they do with themselves. That's their business. But, uh, you know. That's that's my take. That's how I feel, you know. How the fuck did I blow myself up? I have you threw a nade on yourself. I have no idea, bro. Uh, but the nitro cell is a really far away from me. So I, I, I you know maybe not you, but what's uh, what's funny and unusual is that most people who are. Hmm, I, I dabble, I, well, I do more than dabble, I get quite a lot into psychology, you know. And, you know, if you're, like, crazily disturbed by homosexuality or things like that, there's some inner stuff you might want to look at. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I have had a few homosexual friends in the past. I tried to just learn a bit about it. Okay. I don't quite understand how. I mean, I, I, I mean, for me, it's like you know. Again, I don't understand it. I, it's not for me. Homosexuality is not for me, right? But right. I don't see how that. Does, you know, I can't be friends with them. That doesn't mean that. Um, as long as they don't try to. I mean, as long I, as they don't try, more, you know. More so in this day and age, it's all over TV. It's well, this is what I'm talking. Movies. Sorry, this is what I was referring to when I said, as long as they don't try to force feed it to you. You, you know what I mean? Like it, we're it's getting forced on us. Well, right? it is. That's I agree. That's, that's what I don't. I like. am agreeing. Keep it to yourself. We have no problem. I am right. I'm agreeing with you. I, I this is too much. Way too much for too long now. With all that, yeah. I am. I I agree. I understand. Yeah, you, you got moms. Turning their boys into girls before they even know what the fuck the, you know the difference is. Uh, starting to give them porn. This the world is disgusting right now. I I I am in agreement on this with you. So, yeah. But you all right? <laughs> I should probably. I know. I I I should probably stop talking. Because I know I, if I start hearing it for too long, and I get like, and again, I've not really had problems with in in specific views, just the world in general, the way it is right now. I you know, I'll start getting heated. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you watch Blues Clues in the past. I've never watched Blues Clues. What the fuck is it? What the, I mean, 
What? I don't have kids. I was I, I, a kid show, right? I, mean, I, I never had kids, so. I mean, kind of. I wouldn't even know. I wouldn't. Le legitimately wouldn't know how to describe it. song, Johnny Comes Marching Home. That is it. That the beat or Johnny comes a marching home. Hurrah! When John, okay, yeah. So in Blue's Clues, there was this LGBTQ parade, and uh, it pissed me off. I had to turn it off. Okay. I don't understand why five-year-olds should be singing. Well. Yeah, see, and, and I'm with you here. Like, I, we may not hold all the same uh, values when it comes to certain things as what you I mean, said yeah, before. People are going to have different opinions. I hold sure. my values on what I said. Like, you know, do what you do with you, but don't try to force it on people, right? You know? Uh, but that is exactly what's happened to that. The, the, you know, they're forcing it. Uh, and that's not, well, that's absolutely not okay. Uh, 100% not okay. So, you know, um, yeah, I mean, you could, I, you know, talk away about that. That's, you know, that's, I, I've, I'm in agreement. <laughs> that's, uh, it's all bullshit. It's this fucking, it's not, it's just madness. It's complete and utter madness. The lunatics are running the asylum, what? you know. I can't play this game. I can't focus. I get and then every other way. also with guns. By the way, I get so heated every time these cowards shoot up like kids at schools, and then uh, people blame guns. Like in the sixties, there was gun clubs. Listen, in schools, like there's always been gun, like look here. And uh, by the way, most of them, most gun violence, they just toss all in the same category, and a lot of it's gang violence and suicides. By the way, uh, and then on top of that. He had cops with with actual military grade rifles and actual body armor and travel plates waiting for fucking shields for eighty eight minutes while kids died. Uh nah. <laughs> uh but beyond oh, okay. but beyond so, that these people can have can I... semi automatic rifles, but uh if... the government can have fucking tanks. Right. As you said, trauma plates, fully automatic assault rifles. Right. Shit like that. Bro, I've seen on YouTube where a cop had an AT4. He, I, my jaw dropped to the floor. I was like, what the fuck? Why? Uh, if you know what that is. Uh, I, I mean, I was beside myself. Again. An AT4 heat? AT4 heat. Yeah. A rocket launcher. Mm -hmm. a, uh, a United oh. States military grade rocket launcher. I can take out a tank. Um, now I, I sort of semi half lost my shirt off. Oh right, I say people, you know, like a gun is a tool, and we're not we're not focusing on the right stuff. And I, I'll say it again. I just said it on a stream the other day. I don't know if you're still here at all, but uh, look, <laughs> yeah, you're still here. So I mean, look, here's the thing. Uh, I could lay a gun in the middle of the street and watch it. It's not gonna stand up, load itself, rack around in the chamber. And, walk over to a school and start shooting kids. That's not happening. Uh, so, here are the uh, problems as I see them. And it starts with, and by the way, I have no problem with this country, right? But I do have a problem with certain things that have happened in my lifetime, and I said this the other day. So, I'll start here. Capitalist greed is where I want to start. I believe in capitalism, okay? But I don't believe, like, when Obama bailed out the banks and they said they're too big to fail. That's nonsense. That's not how capitalism works. That's how democracy works. You use government funds to bail uh, a private uh, equity organization out. That's not right. You should not do that. Nothing's too big to fail in a capitalist society. That's the whole point. You know, uh, that eight, you know, there's eight banks, eight smaller banks that could take the place and, and do it better and learn from lessons, you know, uh, that's, that's how this is supposed to go, right, okay, and then, moreover, <clears throat> about, uh, in, re in regards to, the, you know, guns not get up and shooting themselves, here's the other thing, capitalist greed is now 
infringing upon what I believe is the most sacred and most important thing in the entire world, which is a parent's time to instill proper values into their fucking children. And that's, I'm, that, I'm exactly like that. So, like, and I'll say it flat out, because I know my uh, sister and my brother-in-law work at home. And how their company perceives that is, well, you already work at home, so there's no reason why you can't work even more than you did before. Well, it's sort of defeatist. They work at home, spend time with their kids, and they're working more than they ever have before because they feel like you should work 24-7 because you're always at home. So there should never be a time when you shouldn't, you know, be, be able to work. So that's taking time away from parents to teach kids the proper values, right? And then this this kid that recently did it literally has a nickname, the school shooter, and, and that brings me to my last, uh, uh, you know, thing on the agenda, which is, not having a proper a proper mental health system in place, you know, you're gonna bail out banks that don't deserve to be bailed out, and give CEOs billion dollar golden parachutes while you're in the means, you know, and and not start a proper mental health program for this country to to assess and figure these things out, flag them early and often, and 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 really just improve the mental health overall in this country. And then, and then, those, that's how I feel. Yeah, that Those are the things that contribute. Sorry, I know I, I ranted a little bit there. You know, but. Did I lose him? I think I lost him. I guess he doesn't agree. Well, such is life, folks. Can't win them all. Can't win them all. God. I'm not gonna make that speech all good for I hope he just listens to it later if you didn't hear it. Because uh, that's a lot. Hello, hello? I can't hear you. Let me call up. I'm sure. Hello? 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 Hello?
sure I did. Uh, what's going on with that? But um, hope you heard what I said because it's a lot to kind of go through. I don't know why I would be able to hear you. It's just silly. Oh, sick. I mean, yeah, I mean, <laughs> he left the party. Fantastic. I guess. Ah, oh, shit. I guess I gotta leave this for a while. Yeah? Hello? Uh, um. Yeah, I don't know, man. I still can't hear your, you, your mic, so... I don't know if you're muted. I know I don't have you muted, so... Alright, now you're all three goes in here. Also, not something I can hear. Why is this being this way? Trying to figure this out. Party option. This doesn't. I don't know, man. This is this is silly. Well, I don't I I don't know if you heard the rest of that. I, it's on the stream. I really do. I mean, hope you listen to it. Uh, if you get it's it's not that long. I say I went on for about five minutes, maybe. Uh, I think it's really important, you know. To me, <sighs> so if you get a chance, nah. Well, about what I like to call capitalist greed, and how I put that is like even parents that work from home, uh are overworked now and don't spend enough time with their, their, their children to teach them values, proper values. Uh, you know, they look at it like, oh, you work from home, no, you should be able to work more even, you know. The whole purpose of working from home is to spend more time and try to get proper values taught their kids and, and they can't do that because, you know, they're, they're constantly working. Uh, and so it starts there and there's no mental health, there's not a proper mental health program in place in this country at all. And so none of these things should, I mean, you're never going to stop it entirely, but I mean, you know, I guarantee a gun threat the problem. Like I said, tools are tools. They don't get up and, and, and operate themselves. People do. And so it starts with what I, what, again, like what I call capitalist free, that they can't even leave people that are working at home so they can spend more time with their family and raise their children correctly, have less time with them. Because they, they look at it like, well, you're home already. There's no reason why you can't work, you know. Always. 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, you know. Uh, and then, you know, so then it starts there with the parents, and then there's no mental health program in place. And then on top of that, finally, you know, it's the media, which drills it over and over and over again. The more you hear about one shooting, if anybody has it in their head at that point in time, it kind of cements it for them, you know what I mean? Oh, I could be that too. 
So there's just a lot that contributes to that, and the least of the things is guns. And I hate how people blame inanimate objects for shit that, people, that humans do, but yeah. That's it. That was all. Anyway, um, my neck is really killing me. So I think I may stream something for a minute, and then I may try to catch up with a couple of buddies of mine in the golf game. Well, uh, but it it was nice to meet you, and I really appreciate that you being here. And uh, <laughs> fraud. Or Freud. <laughs> that popped up quick. You talking about Sigmund Freud? I, I know mine, I, I knew, you know. Right. I wasn't sure what the second word was. Alright. Yeah. Um, yeah, no doubt. Uh, here. In fact, as long as I hope you don't make me regret it, <laughs> the things that you said, you know, that's not really my my thing. It's not really the group that I, uh, I, I you know, associate with. But like anything else, I respect your right to think whatever you want, so. There you go. I mean, that's, uh... Now you should be able to talk to me anywhere you want to, because it's... I only, I think I have it on only friends because I get so much hate mail. From, uh, golf. Being so good at the, the golf game sometimes, I get a lot of, uh... What, what? I don't know. I don't even know what it is. We're both tired. I have no idea what it is. <laughs> All I know is my neck is killing me. And, uh... I sent you a friend's request, so, uh, I'm gonna relax, like I said, maybe stream something, not stream, like, stream here, like, I mean, watch something, and then I might try to hook up with, uh, friends later on, on, a, on the golf game. Alright, yeah, man, it was, it was actually, it was a pleasure, uh, mmm, mmm, nah, 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 <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> Uh, yeah. It was a pleasure. Uh, hope to do it another time. And I appreciate the follow. I appreciate you engaging in conversation here. <laughs> that means a lot. Have a good one. Last life, I guess. Fuck it. Oh, shit. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> then, to all my guys and gals, boys and squirrels, lords and ladies, 
to each and every single one of my non-binary gender fluid snowflakes out there. This is the show showing you love. Most definitely. Signing out. Have a good week.